Good morning viewers, the Colonel speaking to you live from the Grange British Imperial YouTube Broadcasting. And here's what we're playing today. A 7 inch uh, HMV private recording, number AS43. And it says here, play this side first and hear something to your advantage. Now, pardon me Vicar, I think it's something to do with underwear. Yes, it's, it's a private recording from Woolsey Limited of Leicester. Uh, advertising their sort of prize competition for shop girls in haberdashers, that sort of thing. And on the other side is Wedding in the Ark, Foxtrot, by a dance orchestra. Maybe you can identify the dance orchestra. I can't. <laughs> but then I'm uh, not very good at that sort of thing. Here we go. Not very good at any sort of thing, really. Here we go. Hello. This is the chairman of Woolsey Limited speaking. Woolsey of Leicester, the underwear. I want to remind you about our competitions prize scheme that starts on Thursday, September the 25th. A thousand pound prize. Very tempting. Do you know that the last time we had a competition, over a million people went in for it? To win the prize this year, your customers must buy a Woolsey Underdog and send your receipted bill for it to us at Leicester, together with an estimate of the number of garments made by the Woolsey Company in 12 months. We are helping everybody by publishing the average number made during the last three years as a guide. Everyone who enters the competition has to buy a Woolsey undergarment. So your sales of Woolsey this year are bound to be increased. And don't forget, there's a hundred pounds waiting for you. A hundred pounds for you if the winning estimate is sent in with a receipted bill from your underwear department. And a further fifty pounds to be divided amongst your assistants in the underwear department. That ought to make them enthusiastic. We are backing you up with a big propaganda campaign lasting a month. Starting off with a full front page in the Daily Mail. We really think that the scheme will help you a lot. People have come, got to come to you for entry form and to buy wood. Well, here's luck, goodbye, and thank you. Well, viewers, this is where we turn over. But what a peculiar bloke. I thought he actually said that £50 should be divided amongst the <laughs> shop girls' underwear. Very tempting. What a funny bloke. Don't think we're related at all.
Well, there we go, viewers. That's one of the strangest records I've ever played. That bloke was very peculiar on the other side. Thank you, and goodbye.